Hello everyone, Joseph Buer here and I just want to share a quick tip that I just learned in Krita and it's how to uh, create uh, clipping layers or uh, at least it's Krita's ver version of a clipping layer. Uh, so clipping layers for those of you who don't know are basically just um, uh, layers on top of other layers that where the, um, the transparency is limited to uh, the um, pixels that take up the layer below it. Uh, so basically uh, we have this red dot right here. Uh, let's just give you an example. We have this re I have this red dot right here in Photoshop on um, its own separate layer and then the layer above it I've made into a clipping layer and you do that by you know positioning your cursor between the two layers holding down alt and just clicking. So right now it's, it's not a clipping layer. I click it again. Uh, it's uh, a clipping layer as indicated by this little arrow. And basically what that means is now um, if I draw on the canvas the only areas that are affected are the areas that are taken up by that red dot. And this is a very handy feature uh, especially if you're doing any kind of uh, comic art or any kind of shading on um, objects and such. It just makes your life a whole lot easier. Uh, we can see if I go ahead and shut that off we can see all the, the lines now as they would be had, had I not had clipping layers um, enabled. So anyway I want to show you how to do this in Krita because it's not as obvious in Krita as it is in Photoshop. So the way you do it in Krita is you have to have uh, a group layer set up first. And then, um, then you have your layer at the bottom, the layer that you want to act as your uh, pretty much the, the thing that's going to determine the transparency of your uh, upper layers. And then uh, right here, this, um, this, I think it's, inherent alpha if we go ahead and select and hit those two now it's yes isn't it's set to yes we are inheriting the alpha of the bottom layer so now if we go ahead and oops now if we go ahead and draw on one of these layers I'm just gonna select layer 3 we can see that it is acting now as a clipping layer and if we go above here to this one make that a yellowish color it's having the same effect if we just go ahead and turn these off we can see how that's working now for some reason this only works in groups um, if I go ahead and if I go ahead and select these and move them out of the group and just go ahead and delete the group drag this to the bottom we can see that these no longer are working so if we they need to be in the group in order for it to work um, anyway so that's my quick tip I hope you found it useful and um, yeah, uh, look forward to uh, more videos in the future on topics such as these.